Welcome to our channel. I'm Fred. And I'm Donna. In 2020, we got the opportunity to work fully remote, so we sold, donated, or stored all of our belongings. We sold our house and took the leap to pursue our dream of full-time travel. So we packed up our motorhome Libby, which is short for Liberty, and along with our dogs Kona and Layla, we hit the road. We tow turbo our Jeep Wrangler Adventure Vehicle. We're glad you're here, so come along and join us on our adventure as we travel the country looking for our view. Now they have several campgrounds here. I would call them loops, but they have different names and we are in the circle drive loop and we got a full hookup but it looks like there's very few sites that have full hookup most of them are just power and water and also there's the i hope you can see it the different prices we're here September of 2022 and so those would probably be the current prices for today here's the ranger station we got here after four in the afternoon on a Sunday and the ranger station was closed but it said for us to just proceed to our site because we had paid online and we had reservations and so we did. Nobody's ever said anything any different to us. Once you leave the ranger station, you come to a Y in the road and, and for the campgrounds you go to the left. If you need a dump before you go to your site, there's a dump station off to the right. This is one of the picnic areas with a little pond there. So you're kind of sitting beside the sitting beside the pond while you're having a picnic. See right up there there's some a little picnic shelter looking building or maybe an old house and looks like maybe a monument up there of some sort you can hike up to if you're so inclined. Here's the El Cortalejo Pueblo Ruins and there's a little monument over there that we had hiked to. some cabins you can stay at and then we're coming up to the lake The entire lake is part of the state park, so there's camping on both sides of the park. It's a really pretty little lake. And middle of September, it's been hot. Today it's like 91 degrees out.
Wetland Campground. I think that's dry camping. bad thing that I see about these campsites along the water is that bathroom over there is closed for repairs. Now this camp, camp loop has power and water on this end. And this is the circle campground. Not right on the lake, but you can see the lake, and it's a nice short walk over to the lake. This is Sunday afternoon, and actually the campground is pretty full this weekend, but it looks like we're just going to have a few of us left for the week. Now starting here with Site 38, I believe, they're full hookups because we all have sewer hookups here. And as you can see, peekaboo view through there. There's a play area back there. This is our site, number 41. We've been very pleased with our site. And then this bathroom over here is working. And there's a little snack shack, boathouse down there by the swimming area. We've seen some signs about some algae, and so we haven't gone swimming. It, it said not to allow your dogs to go swimming. So right here is the boat launch. As you can see, it's pretty steep. So you'd really need a good truck to pull your boat out if it's got loaded up and everything. But we have seen a few people out on their boats. Not too much, not any noisy motors. I don't know what the regulations are, but the neighbors had a catamaran or a party barge that they had their family out on. Okay, so we're taking you on a ride around the lake. Neighbor said it was a seven mile drive all the way around the lake. And you'll see here in a minute that there's other little campground areas too. So this is the Lakeview Campground, Sites 101 to 118. And I think they have just water and power here.
We reserved our sites online. Okay, and this is Timber Canyon, sites 701 to 703. But the thing that I'm finding very interesting is there's no bathrooms over here. Several of, it, I, so far all we've seen is one bathroom for the entire campground and there's a lot of sites here. Okay, there's, there's a pit toilet camp, or uh, bathroom. I've really liked this campground, however, if you come here, bring your supplies. There isn't a lot of, there's no camp store. There, the, the nearest grocery store is in Scott City, which is maybe 15, 20 minutes uh, south of here. 